Hello friends, this is Amit Ranjan and you are watching your favorite channel Java Mitra. What is collection? Collection framework provides set of classes and interfaces that represents functionality of different collections like set, a collection of unique items, map, a collection of key value pair, list, a collection of objects. The object may be repeated, the values may be duplicate, hash table and vector. These two classes are legacy class. It provides a unified model to perform basic operation on all these collections. So if collection is there, the basic information is just like adding some object, removing some object from the collection. Iteration, if you have a lot of items in a collection object, then how to iterate and fetch all the objects. Java.util package provides classes and interfaces. So if we want to use collection frameworks, classes or interfaces, we need to import Java.util package because all the classes and interfaces are inside the java.util package. Code of collection framework, there is an interface named collection. So there is an interface named collection. This interface provides methods that support all collection. That means whatever classes and interfaces we will use in collection framework will have following methods. Like adding some item, add math is there. If you have already a collection and you want to add into another collection, then you have add all method. So add method is used to add an item in a collection. However, add all is to add all the elements of a specified collection to some another collection. If you have two different collection objects and if you want to add all the items of a one collection into another, then you will use add all method. The Signature is here, public, boolean, and all, and collection. Remove, and remove is to remove an element or a collection. Okay, so there is two different uh, flavor. First one is remove, to remove one item, and remove all to remove a collection from another collection. Retain, retain is something different. To remove all the elements of invoking collection that are not part of the specified collection means if you will invoke retain all method on a collection then it will remove all those objects that are not present in the specified collection okay. suppose calling retain all like uh, c1 dot retain all c2 this means the items that are not part of c2 will also be removed from the c1 c1 dot Written all C2. That means the items that are not exist existing in the C2 will also be removed from the C1. Contains method is to search an item whether it is present in your collection or not. To search an element, you can call contains method, and to search a collection within another collection, you need to call contains all method. Size to get the size of the collection. How many uh, elements are present in your collection object you can get with the help of size method and clear to remove all the elements of collection if you have a collection with a, a lot of elements and you want to remove all the elements at once then just just call the clear method it will remove all the items from your collection object iterator method is there to get a iterator reference i will take, talk about it later you should know that iterator method will help to fetch all the items from a collection object. So how to add an item, add method or add item. How to remove, remove or remove all them. And how to uh, fetch all the, or how to access those data or those elements from a collection with the help of iterator method. 